This is a seven-sided gold die. It has six outsides and one inside. The inside is invisible, but you know it's there. It's like a block of gold. The first thing you want to do is find that block of gold. You've heard about thinking outside the box. This is from thinking inside the box. You think from the inside out. That block of gold is you. Benjamin Franklin used to take a sheet of paper and he would divide it in half. He put the pros on one side, the cons on the other. We can look at things short term, long term, cost, benefit, right or wrong, fast or slow. Any one thing that we want to do our best on, if we'll begin to take that one thing and divide it down, we'll begin to understand it better. There is two sides to every what? Story. Two sides to every story. So, if we want to do our best on any one thing, we've got to make sure that we understand both sides of the story. There's actually what we know and everything we want. Don't know. Everything we don't know. Okay. Benjamin Franklin used to take a sheet of paper, and he would divide it in half, like this, and he'd put what on this side? The pros here and the cons. That would allow him to begin to make a decision with in life right now, you're having to make decisions. You're not, not only are you have to look at pros and cons, you have to look at long term and short term. That's exactly right. Every single thing that you look at, long term you've made a commitment to your career by being in school. And by making that commitment to being here, you understand that if you will do your best on that one thing and make sure you balance that plate, then it's going to benefit you in what? The long, long term. Sometimes we have to make some short term sacrifices to be able to take care of the long term. How many of you ever found yourself in a situation where you didn't understand anything, you didn't understand, you couldn't understand, you couldn't understand, and then all of a sudden, it what? Uh, yes. Yeah, all of a sudden it dawned on you. You knew it. You got it all. Right? That's because you was persistent. That's because you persevered, that you pressed in, you pressed in, you pressed in, and you did not allow the what? The short term frustration that you were feeling at the moment to allow you to, to get derailed. By staying consistent, by staying on track, you literally can do your best on anything that you choose. Realize that that one thing, no matter how big it is, we can break it down into smaller pieces. We can constantly break it down. Now on side three, I want you to sort of put yourself right here in the middle. Okay, you're right here in the middle, that's you. And what literally happens if you're committed to do your best on any one thing, you're gonna to wanna to talk to the person over here on your right. You're going to want to get some outside advice. You're going to want to get some recommendations and see what it is that you need to know about that one thing. But then that person's going to be gone, and who's going to be left? You. Know, you. That's right. Only you. But then there's going to be somebody else over here on your left. And you need to talk about that person, and you get some advice and recommendations. And three, we're right here in the middle. This is us. We want to talk to the person on our right and get some advice about that one thing that we want to do our best on. But that person is going to be gone before long and who's going to be left? Just us. Us by ourselves. And then we're going to want to talk to the person on our left or another person who knows about that one thing that we want to do our best on. We're going to take their advice, their recommendations about that one thing and then they're going to be gone and that's going to leave us to ponder actually begins to create for himself a list of all of the activities. He's looking at both sides and he's beginning to understand who he needs to what? Seek advice from. Okay? He's seeking advice and recommendations and so what has happened to his knowledge? It's growing. It's expanding. It's growing. It's expanding. We don't know what we don't what? No, we don't know what we don't know. But as we begin to focus, and as we begin to understand, to listen, to see both sides, and as we begin to seek advice, those things that we used not to know, 
now we begin to understand. We begin to understand. We begin to know those things. As we know those things, then we can expand to the to the next level. Let me pause right there and take a few questions. <laughs>